Hey guys, welcome to Solar React Talk. Today I'm going to be reacting to World of Warcraft cinematics and trailers, playlist done by Jesse Forth. Uh, this is part 23. If you want to check out my previous parts, I'll put the playlist, playlist or card <laughs> right up here. Just click on it and you'll be able to access it. Okay, let's start. Three, two, one. Mazatar, Mazatar. Oh, okay. I, I have to practice <laughs> pronouncing this word. Um, yeah, Asra is back with the Naga, and there's different types of Naga now. Like in Warcraft Three Reforged, they weren't. They all kind of look the same, you know. But in this one, they're different colors. There's some that are big. There's some that are, uh, I think, a bit smaller. They have all different types of weapons and stuff like that. Yeah, it's interesting and uh, you can see that Gen is shipwrecked on this island I'm not sure how wait there was like a laser beam coming out of the water and then it just parted the water away yeah so that's how we got onto the land there um, yeah new map new places to battle uh, Pathfinder I'm not sure about that character I'm not sure um, yeah, it, it all looks very nice, all looks very uh, fun. I'm not sure if you guys had fun playing it, but to me it looks fun. Um, and she has... How many eyes does she have, Asra? <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, let's continue.
Okay, you know what guys, this is where the Alliance needs those airships. Where are those airships they used to use in Legion, uh, in, in, in World of Warcraft Legion? Like, where, where is that airship? Where is it? Also in Cataclysm they used an airship. Yeah, I think from Cataclysm onwards they've been using an airship. Did they only have one airship or did they have like a fleet of them? What happened? I mean, this thing about sailing on the ocean, it's just not working out. <laughs> they need those airships again. Um, yeah, I guess that's how they got shipwrecked on the... I can't say it's an island, though. I, I don't know. I, I just I can't really say that it's an island. Because I think the water is being kept at bay. So that means if that force field is gone, you know, the water will just come back crashing uh, and swallowing up the piece of land that's been, you know, exposed. So, yeah, I can't really say it's an island. Hmm. Yeah. But it's good to see her again, Asra, her laughter. <laughs> okay, I can't laugh like her, but yeah, <laughs> it's funny. The team is getting back together, guys. Oh, yeah, those are the good old days. Uh, what was it? Warcraft 3 Reforged <laughs> battling against um, Akumande. Oh man, those are the days, yeah, yeah. It's, I'm actually just reminding myself of that of that battle, you know, trying to keep um, Akumande. Um, confused and you know focusing on them instead of focusing on going to the world tree you know <laughs> trying to irritate him trying to you know direct him to uh, another place just trying to waste time you know so that um, storm mage can prepare his spell so yeah good old days
Okay. Um, who is the blood elf with Jaina? I don't know that character. I think he's a new person. But no, but he looks old. Um, could he be Prince Kale maybe? But nah, but didn't he die? Okay, I'm not sure who that is. Um, yeah, in the comment section, you guys can tell me who that is. And it seems that Asra was supposed to complete a mission to do something, to unlock a key or something, a door, maybe, I don't know. I don't know what was going on there, in fact, you know. Uh, but it looks like the old god, what's his name? Uh, no, 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 Zonth, no, Zonth, Zonth. <laughs> I can't pronounce his name. It's some in my book here, but yeah. Um, he rescued Asra, I think. I think she was dead and then he resurrected her somehow. And he pulled her out of that bubble. So I, I'm not sure what else is going on there, but it looks like it's dangerous. It looks like he's free, maybe. Hmm. Yes, I'm going to play free a Everyone, a toast to 15 years of World of Warcraft. We met many years ago upon a dusty road. You, a humble priest, and me, a feeble rogue. We were the weakest of the weak, the lowest of the low. But when we fought together, our legend did grow. We battled our way from Black Rock Spire to Molten Core. Took 40 hours for Ragnaros and only wanted more. Our days of being weak are firmly in the past. And now our shields are stronger. Our bombs are built to last. So whether you're for the Alliance or if you're for the Horde, it's time to toast to 15 years. Everyone no enemy can defeat us. There's no battle we can't win. When we crunch the numbers, stand together and be war Fifteen years, man! It's an old game. It's a very old game. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. World of Warcraft Classic. Huh. Sylvanas' actions have threatened us all, and day by day, her power grows. If our world is to survive, we must strike while we still can. Meet with me, and we will speak. So few. Enough for one final assault. If that fails, we're done. If we end her reign, what kind of war chief will you be? The horde I joined was birthed in blood, tainted by corruption. The road that led to the dark portal was long and wide, paved with the bones of innocence. We called it the Path of Glory. That was the great lie upon which the Horde was founded. That anything we did was honorable. 
thrall, Vulcan. They were not the true heirs to Blackhand's bloody legacy. Sylvanus Windrunner is. No. No, this is the Horde. Led by you. Someone who has... Honor. I've never known honor. They deserve more. But the Horde is doomed to be shackled by the chains of the past. The Horde has no exclusive claim to regrets. Arthas, Dalen... The ghosts of the past haunt us as well. We could not fill the chasm between the Horde and Alliance if we labored a thousand years. You know this. Then what are we fighting for? Soldiers, on your feet! Start breaking camp immediately! Lord Safang? Zakan, where is our home? Orgrimma? Not our city. Our home. Azeroth. And ours? Azeroth. Right now, there are only two forces in this world that matter. One bent on harming our world. And one that will protect her. So... What are we doing? Breaking the cycle. Okay, I got it wrong. When <laughs> Sorafane was asking, uh, where's our home? I thought he meant the Horde. <laughs> but he meant Azeroth. Okay, okay, I was wrong. Um... Yeah, I'm just wondering what kind of political dispensation or leadership role is going to, you know, come out from all of this. Because I can see um, King Anduin wants a resolution to this. He wants to know who's going to be the new next, uh, the, the next um, war chief. And Sora Fang is also not sure about this thing about a war chief, you know. Am I worthy of it? Who is worthy of it? Um, he doesn't really know what's going to happen next. And neither do I. I mean, I don't know. Are they going to have like a, a unity state? A unionary state of some sort? I'm not sure. Um, where they elect who will be the leader of both the Horde and the Alliance. That's madness. But I like it. Will it happen? I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. There has to be a horde and there has to be an, an alliance. So I'm not sure about that. Um, yeah, it's interesting. Their only home is Azeroth and they must fight for it. You know, this is a recurring uh, mantra, you know, that's been happening in, in uh, World of Warcraft. Whenever there's an enemy, especially when it was uh, the Burning Legion, whenever the Burning Legion was... Uh, trying to invade Azeroth or trying to, um, you know, control the leaderships of the Horde or the Alliance, uh, there will always be those who would say that the only home we have is Azeroth, the only home uh, that we have in this entire universe is Azeroth and we must defend it and thus we must work together. This mantra has been there this whole time. So it's nothing really new, nothing surprising. It's just, you know, what, what, what chomis, we're friends, you know. We, we hate each other sometimes, but then when we are threatened or when we are both threatened, we join up, join up together and we fight against the enemy. So yeah, it's nothing really new. Well, a 
brothers and sisters. These warriors have sworn to fight for you. Many lives will be lost. Or perhaps just one. Sylvanas Windrunner! I challenge Makora! A traitor leading traitors. Why should I accept your challenge? You want to make me suffer. Overlord falls. I trusted you. And so did they. Death comes, old soldier. And all their hope dies with you. You failed. Hope remains. You set us to kill each other at Lordaeron. You failed. Here we stand. You just keep failing. The Horde will endure. The Horde is strong. see yourselves as I see you. Toy soldiers in tin plate. Beasts who howl for honor, standing as one. Savor it. Nothing lasts.
If you could see yourselves as I do, you toy soldiers in tin plate, beasts who howl for honor, standing as one, savor it. Nothing lasts. Ah! 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 Look, look, okay, look, 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 just wait, just, just hold on a minute, okay, just hold on a minute. I know we have to beat her, I know I've been disappointed in her, I know I've been angry, but I'm falling in love with her all over again. <laughs> I'm falling in love with this character all over again, all over again from start. Ah. Ah. Uh, when she said the horde is nothing. <laughs> oh man. And and the face is like the the what the, the, the lady or the man soldier who was holding the ban on looked at Salvanus like, huh? <laughs> what do you mean the horde is nothing? <laughs> and it's like all of you are nothing. I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, nobody here is of any significance to her. So what does she mean when she says savor it? What is she doing? What is she doing, guys? Because honestly, you know, the Sylvanas I knew wanted, like especially from the time of the Lich King, she wanted to stay with the Horde. She wanted to be in the Horde, you know, of course, it was a partnership of convenience, right? But she wanted to stay in there. She wanted to contribute to it. And, you know, as it gone through... Um, um, which one? Uh, also, Cataclysm and Legion. And I, I'm not sure about the war, Warlords of Draenor. I'm not sure if I... Yeah. No, I can't remember if she was there, really. If she contributed a lot in the Warlords of Draenor um and pandaria as well i can't remember yeah but you know in legion when she became the war chief and i don't know it's as if she did enjoy the title but now in battle of azeroth it's like a 360 on her you know just like how um what's his name uh the Lich King, before he became the Lich King, Prince Arthur's, how he was also, you know, fighting for his kingdom. He was arrogant, yes, but he was fighting for his kingdom. And all of a sudden, 360 starts betraying his, um, his, his allies, his companions. He starts betraying people, their front and center. Just like here with Sylvanas, she's also like saying, the horde is nothing. <laughs> all of you are nothing. And she's just like, you know, you know what? All of you guys are toy soldiers, busy shouting out on and all that stuff. It's useless. Savor it. It won't last. That means she's doing something drastic. And I'm, what I want to figure out is when did that start with her? When did she just decide, you know what? This world can go to hell. I don't care anymore. When did that notion in the head start? Or was it always there and I just didn't see it? Ah, ah, so fun as woo. <laughs> and look, 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 I am, you know, feeling bad about what happened to Sutterfang, but, you know, as soon as that fight started and she just danced and weaved and swooped around him like that, I'm like, oh gosh, it's over, it's over. And yeah, for Azeroth, for Azeroth, Sutterfang, for Azeroth. Definitely. Oh. She's, she might actually become the most dangerous evil character in this game. I think. I think. I mean, other people like Saragras, they had enough time to try and take over Azeroth. They've always been failing. So, uh, I, I don't count them. I count him as like number two or number three. Number one, I'm going to bet it's going to be Sylvanas. She's doing something. Oh. My heart is pounding. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah. 
Okay, guys, that's that's it for today. Um, remember to give me a like if you like the video. Uh, subscribe and comment on my channel uh, on on this video, <laughs> and <laughs> click on click on the notification bell if you want to be up to date with my latest videos. And I'll see you on Friday for another uh, delving deeper into Battle of Azeroth. Yeah. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> Salvadors. <laughs> Bye.